Inside this rather nice double-sided leather case is both a compass and a barometer, um, which would be perfect for use whilst traveling or for a gentleman to keep in his pocket. And it's double-sided, so you can keep the instrument in the case by opening the one side and you can see there you've got the uh, compass, which has got a mother of pearl floating dial. If you want to look at the barometer, we click open the other side and there you've got the barometer. Of course, you uh, remove it from the case. There we go. Nice tight fit, which is a good sign. And there we've got it with its little fob ring. The case of the um, of the instrument is made out of uh, gilt, a brass with a gilt lacquer on it. A bit of a closer look at the compass there, the floating dial. We've got a little slide button here, which will fix its position. And the maker's name, Lenny of Edinburgh, is to the barometer. James Lenny set up uh, the company who are principally opticians in 1835 in Edinburgh. He died in 1854, but his wife, Eliza carried on the company and actually they became known as E. Lenny by 1857. And like lots of opticians, they didn't just sell glasses. They also sold instruments such as this, but also telescopes and barometers. In fact, we've had a, a, a nice little small pocket telescope by Lenny in the past. Um, the company was very successful. They bought a lot of items in from other good makers to retail instruments by companies like Short and Mason, um, Negretti and Zamba, and the French company uh, Dubois and Cass. And uh, they thrived throughout the 19th century, really. In 1901, Eliza died, but uh, she had three sons and uh, they continued the business with it eventually uh, stopping in 1959. This instrument, um, we're quite lucky, it's uh, tooled to the case where it says um, W E K to A H 1910. So it gives us a date of when it was purchased and given as a gift of 1910. But it really is um, a nice instrument. It's good weight to it and it just just feels quality, you know? Sometimes you pick something up and you just think, yeah, that feels nice. So there you go. A double-sided instrument, barometer and compass by Lenny of Edinburgh. Uh, quite good uh, retailers um, and dated 1910.